Hello everybody, here we are in another tournament game. Today we have the 3 seed dragon versus the 14th seed got. It is paradox, it is ket, it is gold. It's another round of 16 game. Let's go ahead and show off what our players are bringing to the fight. And we'll get the match underway. Who did you want to start with, Union? I'm going to be following Dragon for Wave 1. Copy that. Good luck, Dragon. Uh, yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It'll be a good match. Well, are you sure about that? Well, we're going to find out There's here. There's sarcasm there, but that could really go either <laughs> way, so I don't know what to expect. <laughs> I expect people to shoot things and things to die. There will be explosions. Uh, I can bet on that. There will be explosions. Yeah. And there will be gunfire. Maybe. And we will have a winner. Who will be going to the round of eight. After the loading screen, when we get on the map, I'll be following Dragon. Lingus, my co-host here, will be following Got. Alright, on the map, let's see where Dragon is going. Following him. They're both going to go up here. Nope, looks like Dragon is down here. So I'm going to go right behind this pillar. And wait and see where he's going to go. Enemies are on the field. Dragon and Got going back toward the same spot. And Dragon off to a very, very quick start. Already getting some stuff in the cave. Back toward LZ now, Dragon is going, and Got looks like he is still near the back of the map. So, after the initial enemy spawned on the field, our contestant's going after some different targets. And now Dragon going back. Up pretty quick. Does he? Alright. But Dragon, once again, getting a lot of combos with this Sentinel. Go ahead and check that score early on. It's 1,700. Dragon on top, but it is still very early here in Wave 1. It's going to be a fun match. I don't think that controller is going to think so. Say, Dragon, he is content to bounce back and forth between a couple of spawns. Doing well, it looks like. I'm going to hear some combos from God above. I really don't have to move that much right here. It's uh, kind of convenient. It gives me a different perspective on the map. Down to last few enemies on wave one. And at the end of wave one, it is Dragon on top 3400 to 1700. Following Got here for wave two. Switching to Dragon. No, 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 no. no I want you over there by that castle. I just blew up. Well, enemies are once again on the field. Around. Nice combo by God. Looking for another one, though, quickly. And Dragon, I think he's already found one at the back of the map. God has another one on the bridge. Quickly takes care of this. Now searching for yet another. Check score again. 4,000 to 2,900. Dragon is on top in this matchup. Still early on in Wave 2. Looks like Dragon has a good strategy down there. But God has a similar one going on right above him. Let's see what he's taking on over here. Not too terribly much because it's just about gone. He's retreating just a little bit. Looks like he did get his ascension back and is going to town on everything again in front of him. Looks like the interior of the map probably below has a bit more, but does have a few enemies on the bridge. God has. And we're down to the last three enemies on wave two. Won't be much it longer, but it's cleaned up. up. I think it was. And at the end of wave two, it is dragged on top 5,800 to 5,000. Got really pulled back all of a sudden. Falling dragon for the next wave. I'm going to start a little bit above him. What do we have? It's a hack, so we'll see what our contestants decide to do. Dragon, once right. again, looks like he's going back towards the back of the map to one of his spawns and got more up toward the front. 
Dragon has some Nobody's enemies back here. Just me. Well, I'll try to stay a little bit equal distance between our contestants, but God is closing the gap, coming back toward Dragon and his spawn, but no, doubling back now toward LZ, but now Dragon's coming back up toward God, up toward the Ascendant. Looks like he's content to get the little ones around the Ascendant. Dragon goes down, does get himself back up, and back into the fight, so opting to get himself up quickly Anybody want this to get more kills. Justin that's in here? The dragon's close, he might be able to get it. I'm going to try to stay on top Thank here you, in dragon. case our contestants go down. So Dragon does get down. Dragon on the kill feed a decent amount. Let's go and check that score again. It's 8700 to 7000, so it is a close game here in Wave 3. Both of our contestants going toward the back of the map to the cave again. The hack is moving along quite nicely. And the first Cobra comes out from Dragon. Does get a decent amount with it. Ooh, and better watch out for that sink kill. Does watch out for that sink kill. So Dragon below, trying to hop back up here again. And I need to get out of the way of this Ascendant or uh, she's going to kind of wreck me. So got on the bridge. Dragon in the cave. Hack progressing. It's 10,004 to 7,800 for a dragon lead on wave three. Dragon goes down and got go down in quick succession here. So both contestants uh, found those banana peels simultaneously, just about. But they are still doing great work as the hack is nearly done. Probably one enemy just holding it up for the moment. Going to make a run to this fight. Paradestin, that's what's in there. Okay. All right, that's the end of the objective. Now it's time for the cleanup on this wave. So Dragon following him primarily once again. Going to try to stay out of his way so he can focus on whatever he is doing. Looks like he is fighting something in front of him. Don't have the best target. Ooh, but now he comes back to these deaths where I was. So he killed whatever he was looking at and doubled back down to the last three on wave three. Oh, it looks like, yep, does have that Ascendant. Dragon trying to get this enemy that's kind of laid out near LZ and then doubles back to get this Anointed. And at the end of Wave 3, it is Dragon on top, 15,000 to 12,400. So Dragon has a decent lead going into Wave 4, following Got for Wave 4. Make up your mind, Dragon. Where are you going? All right, Got searching for enemies. Nothing over here, but does see some at long range. Nice combo. Off to the next one. Dragon has found the fiend. Or should I say the fiend has found dragon? Either way, it's there. And God has a few little enemies up by him. We'll quickly take them out and get onto another spawn. But Dragon looks like he's content to bounce back and forth between the uh, front and the back of the map. You know, God's sort of using the bridge to his advantage. Ooh, has a fiend on him now. Better watch out for that thing. 16-8 to 13-2. Dragon's still on top. Got goes down, gets himself back up. That anointed was the thing that took him down. But it looks like that anointing's going to pay pretty quickly, and that it does. Sends him back for Got. Not too terribly much on the bridge anymore. I think Dragon has more back with him, and he does. He has all three remaining all enemies with him. Might just be the fiend now at this point. So who's going to take that fiend? And Dragon takes the fiend. So at the end of wave four, it is Dragon on top, 19-4 to 14-7. Following Dragon here on wave five. Dragon once again, starting low. Got, I think, yep, starting high. So as soon as Dragon goes to his first spawn, I'll drop down there with him to see what he has. And it looks like he is a few enemies in the cave, nothing really to write home about, but it'll be enough to sustain them for a little bit. Cobra comes out, cleans up those two Destin at least. And Dragon has a couple big enemies coming to
playing with a little bit of fire down here with the Fiend and the Ascendant with other little enemies in front of him. Better watch or he's going to get a pincer maneuver. And that he does, he gets picked up by the Fiend. Hopefully he doesn't down him permanently. We will see. And Dragon is down permanently. So Gott has the rest of this wave to clean up and get back into the fight. 21.5 to 16,000 right now. So Gott can get back into this game. Oh, and I just jumped off the map, so I need to not do that as well. But all God has to do is play smart and take the enemies out. Alright, and while he's doing that, I'm going to go ahead and pop a pack so I can stay with the action. So God repositioning. It's more of a solo at this point, but he does have the support from both Avengers now, so he need not fear the enemies too terribly much, just needs to not get sink killed. If he gets sink killed here and he's not able to get back up, then the Avengers will have to finish off the wave and he'll forfeit all of those points to get back into it. Check score again, 21-5 to 18-5. Gott goes down, but being I'm smart... Get me up. I'm yeah, there's, well. Yep, there's no rush right I'm now. I've got like an unlimited amount of uh, revives here, now that I think about it. You do, you just have to stay alive. So Linguist, what are you thinking of this match so far? It's a little bit different than her others this year. <laughs> it's gonna be yeah. Uh, it, it's gone pretty quick, so you guys have, have time to spare now. And not for nothing, but it kind of looked... I mean, I know you were shooting an invisible wraith over here, but it looked like you were shooting Dragon's Corpse. So I was like, what, thirsty? Oh, no, I definitely wasn't doing that. <laughs> Teabagging, you mean. <laughs> <laughs> nope. I'd say this is a pretty typical dragon match. Something... Yeah. <laughs> something goes wrong. <laughs> yeah, it kind of feels like it at this point. I'm not going to lie. I felt that sink kill from here. A little oh, less than 3,000 points there, Linguist, you might now. have to get him. Yeah, you might have to get him. I just jumped down here. Yeah, I, I can get myself up. No, no I'm gonna go this way. No okay. I should be able to if you have to get yourself up when there's two Avengers around you, we have done something. Oh! Yeah. He got grabbed. Oh, and he got grabbed. Will he be permanently down, though? No, he'll be fine. No, he's okay. So Linguist will go ahead and revive him, it looks like. There's only three enemies left. So 21-5 to 19-2. I don't think God's going to be able to pull into the lead, but he'll be able to cut into that lead a oh, lot. Why you waste a Cobra? Why don't you waste a Cobra? Yeah, I don't know. I just kind of felt like timing. And oh, and now the Fiend is glitched from that Cobra. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's basically like, yeah, he's posing or, I don't know, presenting. It's waiting for a treat. Yeah, basically. All right, last enemy. Just needs to take it out, and the match right. will proceed as normal. Kill the orb where we can. Kill the orb where we can, so you can get your attention. Nah, that's a good idea. I think I have it, though. I do. So it's 21.5 to almost 20,000 right now, so... With Dragon's death in this wave, he is given up a big lead. And God has pulled back into it. I think God's playing with his food at this point. I have, I'm sorry, but there is a purpose for doing it, and I'm just going to see if yeah. it works. Yep. Alright, now, finally, at the end of Wave 5, it is Dragon on top 21.5 hey. to 20,700, so... Can you man. I think that has changed. Who are you on, Union? I got it all mixed up. You're okay, I'm going to be following Got here. For Wave 6. Now I'm going to go ahead and take this one I'm right here. Alright, I don't know which one I'm in. Let's see. A's over there. You're in C. Yeah, am I? Okay, because I can't see over that uh, distance thing over there with that. Yeah, that's B. I zoomed in on it. So Dragon, nice Cobra. Got, he is deciding to get some extra points by staying in the objective. And it's 23-4 to 217. Dragon's still in that lead. Could have had a bigger one, but that fiend said otherwise. I'm wasting my time here, but that's fine. 
Alright, that one's done. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a couple nades real quick and head to this back one. And I watch from afar. Well, there's another fiend going after Dragon, but I don't think Dragon wants anything to do with this time. God goes down, gets himself back up. I got this union if you want to go watch them. Yep, I'm going to go ahead out and I'm going to see what they're doing. Dragon, he's over here not too terribly much, and God's over here clearing out everything he can, including the Ascendant. Alright, looks like Dragon has now a decent amount on him. That's the end of the objective as well. We're going to slowly wrap up Wave 6 here. So this is probably going to be our longest game so far of this year's tournament. But they all play out differently. So I where is God? Is God is over here following primarily God. And Lingust will be on Dragon for the rest of this wave. Let's go ahead and check that score again. 27-6 to 25-8. Dragon still in the lead. God goes down, is waiting for revive. Nope, I, uh, does get himself back up. Down to the last three enemies here on Wave 6. And they did not last too terribly long. At the end of Wave 6, it is Dragon on top 28-5 to 26-2. So still close going into the extraction wave following Dragon for the final one. And I have a feeling he's going to be right behind me. No, he has that LZ. And did that work? It looks like it did because he has a lot of enemies in range of his combos. And I'm not sure Dragon's really going to be moving too much. He might go ahead and camp it out for the remaining minute and 57 seconds. Although, here comes another Fiend closing in on him. He needs to be extremely careful with that. Dragon doing what he can, dancing around the map. 29-8 to 26-7. Dragon's still in the lead, but he really needs to watch that Fiend. Meanwhile, Gott on the other side, now closing in. Ooh, Dragon goes down, but Gott's slowly coming into the area around LZ. So with both of our contestants over here, now it's going to get quite hectic really quickly. A minute 21 left to go on the clock. 31,000, 27,600. Dragon's still holding that lead. Needs to maintain it. Dragon goes down, gets himself back up again. Still not waiting for a revive. A little over a minute to go in Wave 7. Got a little bit farther out from LZ, trying to get the enemies that are coming in. Meanwhile, another Fiend is closing in on Dragon's position. They really want Dragon this match. And he sprints right over to him on the LZ. Got content to stay away from the bigger enemies going after the smaller ones. 40 seconds to go. On this wave, in this match... I go ahead and grab a couple more nades, and it's down to 30 seconds. The cross map revives are off the table with the Fiend once again closing in on Dragon's position. They have must have a vendetta out for him. 20 that seconds to go. God's still out there. Needs to get through LZ. Ooh, need to watch out for that Fiend myself. 33-1 to 31-5. The lead is for Dragon. And as we come to an end here, it is Dragon will have 36,000 to 33,100. So Dragon does take this match in the end. But first, I would like to talk to you, Got. It was a good match. You had that one wave to get back into it. How do you feel about your performance tonight? Uh, it could have been a bit better, but I mean, it was still fun. And uh, yeah, it was nice to have that extra little boost for me because... Obviously, the score would have been a greater gap without it, right? Yeah, I like to say you uh, played it pretty well getting back into it on that wave by yourself. It was a great match to watch. But at the end of this one, Dragon, you take the victory. You're moving on to the round of eight. How do you feel about your win? I should have died multiple times. That, that is a... Uh...
deaths in these matches, but still overall well played. Final score 36,000 to 33,100. So a great match, guys. Got. Hopefully we can see you back next year. Also, we have the Constellation Bracket coming up. And uh, Dragon, we will see you in the next round. But until next, guys, it's been a good one.